Well, hey there, team. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome to Black Guys at Furious of Darkness. This is a game we're going to have a bit of an overview of today. Um, so this seems to be in the vein of like Baldur's Gate of yesteryear, Pillars of Eternity, I suppose, in a more sort of contemporary thing. You've got the Pathfinder games as well. These CRPG type games. Um, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited to check it out. I, I quite like them. Um, and you know how much I love character creation. Oh, look at this, a Dwarf Highlander. Oh, yeah. Ugh, yuck. That's an elf, I can tell. Oh, look, you got a whole bunch of these pre-mates. We're going to make our own dude. Customize. Because, you know, on this channel, one of my favorite things is creating characters. Clip that and misquote. Well, it's not a misquote if I said it. I'm being facetious. I hate character creators. But, you know, we'll do our best to break it and meddle with it. I'll never understand people putting their own personal avatar. It's not quite as fat as them, or quite as ugly as them, but it's a prettier version of them in the, you know, in, in here. And then they'll put a helmet on their head and spare at the back of their head for 40 hours. What is wrong with these people? All right, hang on. Race and six. Human? Dwarf? What is a Felder My gun? blade is sure. My arrow true. Wow, so you're an even more loser elf than an elf. Right. There were once elven tribes who lived in the close north. Eh. No. What's a Rillo? Cunning serves where violence will not. What is this? He's got tusks? Aren't tusks supposed to be part of your mouth, like to help you eat? I mean, I'm, I'm, I, I don't find myself to be a tusk expert, so I don't know. Right, whatever. It, it's furry adjacent. That's fine. Dwarf breaking though. Breaking rock or breaking skulls. Yes. Same to me. Yes. Rock and stone, baby, to the bone. Cannot be a necromancer. Oh, what a shame. Hey, uh, what a shame. Said no one ever. All right, let's go. Class fighter. Thief. The shadows are my home. Oh. Come, let me show you. So I get a little voice line and an art splash for every single combination. So, like, for example, say we wanted to be a loser elf. My blade is sure. My Shut arrow up. true. Shut up. And then we want to make you a, I don't know, what's the yuckiest? You could be like a winter mage. In the pitiless cold, I reign. Look at this. Look at this. Imagine that. You can, you can be your own fantastical version of yourself and you willingly... Break Not accidentally choose that character. Skulls. I don't know what to do with it. To me. All right, fighter, cleric. Me in all don't know about that. What's a Highlander? Stand Hard and strong you were as. Uh, the profession originated in the harsh north. Oh, yeah, I like this. They prefer thick armor that doesn't restrict their movement uh, and helps them blend in the natural environments. Oh, okay. Well, they can pick up and use any weapon. They prefer clubs and hammers. Mate. These decisions make themselves, all right? Allocate. Oh, look at this. It's going to automatically give me more points. Uh, I love this. Yes. What's this? Physique. Um, supernatural is is low. Displays a feature of characters that elevates them above ordinary creatures. Nah, yuck. I don't need that. That's, that's the wooden spoon. I come last in every race special pat on their head award. That's the people, you know, if you're that guy, put your supernatural through the roof. Make you feel better about yourself. Resistance sounds good. Let's go. All right, Bonza. Where are we at? I love that it just lets me auto distribute. Brewing and drying. Oh, baby. Bargaining and persuasion. Oh, look, if you if you bloody twist my arm, sure. What's this class specific? Seasoned warrior. Command and company. Force locks and doors. Yes. Punch our way into problems or out of problems or probably into problems as well. Clubs and hammers. Throwing, slings and fustables, bows and arrows. I don't know about that game. I don't know what you're trying to do here. What if I just put it all into clubs? Yeah, I like that. I like oh, battle axes, also tempting. We'll go with clubs. What's this? Initial spells. I get spells? Oh, hang on. Challenging Howl, Berserk. Shattering shot. Attempts a ranged attack to disrupt the target's defenses. Eh. Let's get this. Waylay. Disabling attack against a target that aims to prevent their movement. Oh, yeah. And immobilize. Let's do that. A stun lock, if you will. Oh, look at all these faces. Look at this dude. Look at this bloke. He's got a little bow tie and everything. Oh, my God. 
Yeah, okay. Oh, look, look at this sad boy. Jeez. Oh, I don't know about these tusky boys. Can you scroll down? Are they more faces? No, that's filtered by six. Auto assign? No. 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 Stop trying to give me tusks. Nonsense. Ah, oh, look at this dude. Category mortal. Yes. Yes. Oh, what's going on here? He looks like a, a YouTuber. Well, maybe that's what I should pick. This dude as well. Now nah, we're going this bloke. This bloke, little bow tie and the, and the friendly mutton chops. Let's go. Hairstyles. Well, he's kind of bald, isn't he? Facial hairstyle. Give me some friendly chops. Close enough. Hair color. We'll probably go with black, right? Skin color. Oh, probably something a bit darker. You know, let's let's get let's get the character right. Eye color. Fuck, I don't know. We can be have baby blues. Major color. Oh, I, I don't know. Orange and, and friggin' aquamarine. Let's go. Right. All right, name. Oh, you're gonna suggest a name, Army. Feraldor, Ascor, Feraldor, Bajati, Ascor. Okay, I, I'm getting a theme. We'll try something a little different, a little bit outside of our usual scope. There we go. Voice scoundrel. Hmm. No, don't like it. I like this. What? Where's the will? Where's the fight? Correct. Classic exp difficulty. What are the others? Veteran, courier. You want some real challenge? That sounds. That shouldn't that be the simplest difficulty, right? Courier sounds like a thing that delivers you items in a League of Dotas. All right, so let's go next. Look at this, dude. What an absolute chad. Yes. Yes. Um, would you like to enable main quest guidance? You can change this. Oh, fucking, yeah, let's go. Give me that. The Espen Estate. I like these splashes. It's very cute. All right, well, let's get in there, you know? Swing it around a little bit. Let me know if you uh, enjoy this game. We'll see how we go. But we, I'm, I'm setting PBs on these bloody character creators. This is one of the better ones. But, uh, you know, if, if you turn out liking this game, let me know. Maybe we'll do some more episodes, turn into a longer play. Keen as a bean. Could go a good RPG. Oh, why didn't I look here first? And more to the point, why must I come fetch you for every little thing? Sorry. Who are you supposed to be? Sorry. No. No sorries. No. No fault admitted. Sure, I'm on my why way. am I not reassured? Listen. The lords from Isselbright are already here and waiting to be served. And for goodness sake, don't forget to gather your things from your chest before you come to table. Yeah, all right, Berlin. Berlin. Get my crap from my chest or something, can't you? Look at this fountain. Just spewing up water. All right, we can zoom in. You've received a quest. Press O. Roger. Side quest. Journal. Compendium. Close. Right, you can move your character. Oh, <laughs> yes, big dog. Let's go. <laughs> Look at him. What a little Chad. All right, we've got the map. That's pretty cool. I like that. All right. Okay. Get, who put the lights out? What's this dude doing? Woo, amazing. Righto. Bloody charlatan. Doing card tricks for the easily amused. Not so with Gronk. Gronk's a hard boy. He's a Highlander for crying out loud. He knows the rough life. You don't need these bloody fireball trickery spells to entertain people. There you go. The, the character building has already begun. Black guys, the time of day affects the availability of certain NPCs. Oh, that's cool. So they have a cycle. After all, everyone needs a good night's sleep from time to time. You're not wrong. Wow, look at that statue. Make haste, Gronk. The guests are awaiting. Now, I didn't check my chest, wherever the bloody hell that is. What is this, the parlor? Whatever, I don't need my chest. Out of my way. Yeah, exactly. Get out of it. Maybe I should check the main quest. 
The whole day was a rush since the lords and ladies arrived. I should get inside before I get into trouble with my lord. I need to report to Baleen in the meeting room. Might also want to collect my things from my chest before doing that. All right, where's my chest? Master suite, my room. What is this? It's a weird room. Could you make it longer and thinner though? I think that would work for me. Oh, a fine morning star. Yes. All right, inventory. Look, here he is, the little fella himself. I like that they don't zoom in or anything like that. They just make him shorter, whereas another character would probably be taller. All right. No, I want to equip that, please. Can I just double click it? I can and I will. Oh, mate, look at that. Look at that color scheme. Yes, yes. What is this? Infusion of berry juice. Oh, yum. Bloody G fuel. All right, go to the meeting room to find Berlin. Oh, meeting room. And we've got a big bloody circle right there, just in case you can't figure it out. Can I sprint if I double click? No. My little legs are doing the best they can. At last. Ugh, don't go twisting an ankle in all your hurry. Right. You take care of the drinks. Lord Wolcraft and Lady Larenthal prefer wine. Lord Joran would like ale. Lady Virilin and Lord Espen want mead. Go! I don't really like the dynamic of this relationship. The world of Yerengal holds plenty of spoils and riches. You may find some of them in containers of various sorts. Click on a container. Oh, tab key? Oh, here we go. Let's go see what's going on in here. Look at this. Vino me up, baby cakes. Click on a lord or lady to serve them drinks. Hello there. Oh, the staff. I was starting to wonder if you'd all fallen ill with the plague or something. Oh, God. Well, what were you supposed to drink? Lord Walcroft. He looks like a mead kind of bloke. Can't find good servants in the city. Can't find them out here. Oh. What a world. Oops. Okay. Uh, Have they taught you nothing? Uh, no, okay. Hello. Okay, your turn. You're here, finally. Lord Espen, eh? Um, uh, look at him with, uh, I don't know, unironic goatee. He's got to be a wine man. I must have a talk with Belin later. Oh, no. Oh, goodness Hello. me. What about you? Yes, yes, get on with it. Oh, my goodness. If you'd been drinking wine all your life, you'd probably look that way. Um... Uh, yeah. I suppose you expect me to toss you a coin for doing your job. Um, that's the best result I've had yet. Hello. I think that's probably the right one. Well? What about you? Can I just not give this dude anything? He's an elf, so he wouldn't drink actual hard man drinks like, uh, ale. You know this is supposed to be served at room temperature. No, of course you don't. Right. Okay. Done. You say so. Mission succeeded. Hello. Ugh, the carriage was quite stuffy. Who are you? And my throat is sorely parched. Oh, you know what'll rush that down? Uh, some mead. Just what I wanted for a change. I know you just find Lady v v Varila, or whatever your name was. Lady V. Shall we do business, gentlemen? Gentle ladies? Yeah, let's do it. Yes, let's. We are convened to discuss the situation with Daron Gould. What has been rumored and suspected for so long has finally come to pass. Oh. A council of nobles with mining interests in the town have declared themselves independent from the crown of Isilmoral. Good for them, I say. I don't like this dirty business. Sending a list of grievances to the king. Sounds more like the actions of a bunch of uppity peasant farmers than nobility. Right. There are ways these things are done. Uh, okay. And there are ways that kingdoms may crumble. I understand your feelings on the matter, Lady Larenthal, but Darren Gould enjoys the sympathies of many important persons here in the North. Oh my god, these voice actors. Among them. What's more, there have already been defections among the Azimeral nobility, most recently Aldenar. Yeah, I can. She speaks of your son, Lord Espen, who chose to forsake his birthright to join the rebels. You're losing me, game. I really hope this room's gonna get hit by a meteorite ah, or something. Yes. Thank you, Lady Larenthal, for reminding me. And I'll thank you, Lady Virilin, not to speak his name on this estate, nor in my hearing again. Oh, gee, okay, right. Oh, 
why I will. Yeah. But you won't. Whatever the loyalties of uh, the young Lord of House Espen, the Southern nobles have many legitimate complaints. Heavy. Some say ruinous taxes. Oh, men of the people. Delayed shipments thanks to the Crown's regime of inspections and checkpoints. The King's insistence that Daron Gould's military, e even the town watch, must be trained in the north. It's quite a list. Yes, it's all very sad. Oh my I'm God. sure they toss and turn the night away on their beds of gold bars. Taxation and bureaucracy are simply the facts of managing a prosperous nation, of keeping our enemies at arm's length. How long would their precious minds keep producing without the king's protection? Oh, uh, maybe. Maybe there's a, there's a point know, in there. I heard this rebellion was prompted in part by a belief making the rounds in Deron Gould that the king himself is cursed. Oh my god, C <laughs> can we get on with it? Oh my! What exceptional nonsense! <laughs> Have they been breathing the fumes of their own minds? Yeah. All right, it's going to go one of two ways. Either I've, this game is some, it's made for stuck up silver spoon people, which I very much doubt, but hey, an audience is an audience. Or they're setting these people up to be just so obnoxious, they're all about to just get obliterated and killed. All right, very amusing. But like Lady Varellen, I am not unsympathetic to our southern friends. Oh. Surely some of Isildbright's rules and dictums could be culled, especially if it means avoiding war. A much more costly proposition than losing a handful of coin in... Wise yeah. counsel, my friend. Yeah. yeah, But I fear the time for compromise is already passed. Uh. The message from Daron Good was deliberately provocative. Uh. Leaving the king no way to negotiate or save face. Oh, goodness. The time has come, lords and ladies, for us to commit our forces and our purse. Or. Yeah, or. Throw in with the rebels. They have the gold. They have a well trained. Oh, army, sacrilege. Most well, actually, no. They uh, control uh, the mines. In a conflict of any significant length, having control of the source of the kingdom's metals means they must only outlast the north. Rather than outright defeat her. You there. What is your opinion on recent developments? Are you kidding? I'm just a dude that pours the wrong drinks. You're asking the errand boy? What does. Kindly do not interrupt me while sitting at my. Oh, table, Lord Espen. He's me. Okay. Alright. Well, speak up. Alright, Daddy Espen, what's this? Peaceful solution sure will be best. Whether or not Darren Guild has legitimate grievance beside the point, they must be crushed. To do otherwise would invite rebellion from every quarter. Since I have little experience in political matters, for me the wisest course is silence. Nah, that's that's a cuck choice. A peaceful solution must always be best, especially if the only point of contention is money. Wait. Well, no, I, no, I want to back the rebels. Whether or not Darren legitimate grievances, they must be crushed. Oh, well... Fuck, I guess I'll say this one at the top. Very noble of you. I agree that the value of gold must be held cheap against the value of doing the honourable thing. Oh, okay, you seem like you've got your head screwed on. Oh, okay, my game's hitched up, so I guess something's happening. Oh, God. My meteor predictions come true. Oh, even better, an earthquake. My ladies, my lords, we are under attack. Yep. Please take shelter at once. Yes. Perhaps the cellar. You may wish to arm yourselves, my lords. All right. Uh, how much time do we have? Too little, I'm afraid. Their numbers are overwhelming. We were forced to fall back to the main gate, and they're already. Oh no. Surely they will listen to reason, wherever they're from. Look, <laughs> this bloke's been living, working from home too long. They won't kill us out of hand like so many soldiers. They wouldn't dare. Right? You're Calmly, idiots. my friends. Let's all go out to meet them. They're not bandits after all. Are you insane? Yes. Go ahead. You have my blessing to speak on my behalf if it's of any use. Oh, he's, it's a setup. He's going to get them all killed. What? Where are you going? Come with me. Make haste. Oh, me and Espo are bailing. Oh, shit. Hang on. Wait for me. Thirsty work. Thirsty work indeed. You. And you lot with me. Well, what is it, my lord? That the sound? The gate has already been breached. The house of Espen is about to fall to the agents of Daron. Oh, no good. Now, never mind that. 
Just fall. And you, ready your weapon. Yes. With all the time you spent training under my master of arms, you must be able to defend yourself by now. You bloody better believe it, boss. Alright, where's he going? This losing line of sight thing's interesting. Over here, Gronk. Here I am, baby. Oh, you want me to talk to you? Oh, everyone for combat has started. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Left control during combat. What does that do? Hang on, combat is uh, you're free to stay out of the fight this time around. Soldiers of the estate can handle themselves. If you decide to engage the attackers, um, uh, clicking on them will send your character attack. You can also attack both hostile and non-hostile creatures. Oh, okay, with left, left control. Each turn takes five seconds to pass. Oh, if, they, if they're going to handle it. Oh, shit. No, I'm going to bash you. Oh, Bloody God. hell. Unbelievable. What are my abilities? Hang on. What do we got here? Challenging how? What is it? Uh, show, tell me what this is. Prolonged Berserk. That sounds pretty good. Let's do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bash your head in. Keep bashing. I thought the guards were supposed to win this fight. Oh no, they are. They're just behind there. Yes! My first kill. It's good. Oh yeah, get busted up. Is there someone still there? I think there is. Mate, I'll kill everyone. All right, let's I'm go. Going. Let's go. Right, so my spell disappears. Ah, oh, poo. They're not getting past us. Watch your step around up. Oh, here we go. Build him. Yeah, next bloke. <laughs> what was that? Yeah, I was 1v1, you mate. Yeah, take that, you grub. Alright, where'd the Lord go? Oh, he's gone back here? Right, Roger Dodger. Guard this door with your life. Gronk, come with me. Oh, okay, he seems to really like me a lot. Now listen to me. Alright, here we go. Closely. This is important. The Lady Espen was the love of my life, my one love. There was nothing arranged about our betrothal. <laughs> Perhaps we best read ourselves. Can we talk about you did what some other time? <laughs> we haven't time for your smart remarks. <laughs> you never saw her yourself. Not that you'd remember. Are you my dad? But if you had, she. Gods damn these Derongul swine. Behind me is my dressing chamber. Go fetch my sword from there. Alright, I'm ready to fight. Fetch your own sword. At, at once. Alright. Where am I going? So. Wait, he's locking me in. Oh, he's tricked me. Search all the rooms, leave no one alive. Oh, savagery. Lord Eldnar. Oh! Suffering your jocks, Beryl. Whatever your name was. You at last, father. Didn't figure you would try and hide from your fate. Oh, it's his son. Be betrayed by my own son. Who wouldn't hide from such a terrible man? I've learned a few things, you see. Yeah, right. Things your priests and men at arms could never teach. I have gained a new perspective. Seen the truth of this world. Yeah, right. Eh? So, you were not even paid in coin to turn traitor against your own house. Only pretty words. Right. Kill me if you wish. But I promise it will avail you nothing. Every man pays for his sins, my son. And the price of a sin such as this. Well, yeah, right. Of your piety. It sickens me. But your last decision, at least, is the correct one. Hold still, father. Jeez, a lot of teen angst going on here. Grog! Why are you yelling my name? You trying to give me away or something? 
Don't worry, my child. Your oh. hardships are over for today. I, okay, guess I'm dead then. That, sure, and there's a crazy lady in my head. All right, the crone's cottage. Uh, okay. All right, I'm confused. So I'm, I'm his, uh, I'm his dwarf son, is that <laughs> That can't be right. That can't be what's going on here. I don't know, maybe, whatever. All right. Get up, lazy boy. It's time to go to bed. Uh, this doesn't make any sense. Speak for yourself, you're the one lying in mouse droppings in a hut in the forest. Um, uh, why am I in your hut? I brought you here. Oh, it's going to be like that, is it? No more questions for tonight. There's a cot over there. You should try to get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow will be a very, very oh, long this, this chick's day. chewing up the scenery. Let's, let's go. All right. You can send your character rest by pressing the rest button. Resting will replenish some of your health, restore spells and abilities. Beware those sleeping out in the wilds comes with the risk of attracting beasts. Right. Right, where's the rest? There's the rest button. Bonza. Let's go. Wake up. Lazy. Oh. Always sleeping, this one. Y you told me to- been raised by dream race. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, hey, just because you've clearly never heard of beauty sleep doesn't mean that you need- No. Piss off. Good morning. That it is. Good morning for getting work done. Now. How about you make yourself useful and weed the garden? Uh, can't you tell I'm grieving? Eh, wrong. Uh, uh, hold on. I have some questions. Be real, I'll ask you questions. Be warned, I can't guarantee uh, answers. Do you know Lord Espen? Yes. I knew him. A good man, but a bad father. Get that look at your safe face. His own son killed him. He can't have been much of a patriarch. You're yeah, right. How did I end up here? You must know you were about to die, so I whisked you away to my little hideaway. Oh, okay, I guess we can do that. De Deus Ex Machina in the first 30 minutes. Okay, sure. That's great. Um, who are you? Just an old witch who likes her privacy? Yeah, all right, okay. Bugger it. I'll go gardening. That's what I like to hear. Now I'll be making a stew this evening. You'll be helping. I'll need you to go find some Take things for us. Take a look at this list. Once you've read it, let me know, please. Oh, great. Let's go get tin board pelts. Can I go through your cupboard? Probably shouldn't take that. I don't think it's going to go well for me if I do that. Strong magical forces keeping the door shut. To read the list, open your character's inventory. Get a hand of bruise root, one brown stem mushroom, a slab of fox meat. All right. Now what do I do? I want to. I want to leave. Strong magical forces keeping the door shut. Feeling well. Oh, good, good. You know how to read. I have something that will help you gather what we need without hurting yourself. Too much. Yeah, all right. Here, put these on. I got some clothes. Oh, some gloves. Let's go, baby. Look at that. All right, let me go now. All right, cool. Strong magical force holding the door shut, eh? Who's this goose? Yes. Greetings, fellow Travia. I am Valendia. Please forgive me. I seem confused. I'm not well just now. Dreadic Order sent me to heal this forest. There's an invasive species of spider. Ugh. But they have unfortunately got the better of me. I've been bitten. The venom as well. I cannot continue. Right. Yellow spiders are destroying the natural balance of the area. I'm too weak to fight them. Perhaps you could finish it. You were foolish confined in a stranger. I should uh, attack him. No, I think we won't do that. How did you come to be poisoned? Stomping bugs isn't my line of work. Oh, I'll help this poor bugger. Bugger it. Thank you for serving the green mother. Oh, it's steady on there, son. All right. I'm just going to help out some poor poison prick that seems to be a good bloke. There are four places in the forest the infestation is thickest. Colin is in the north, south. Another bunch near a conspicuous book, bush also to the south, and one of the old bridge to the west. Yeah, okay, okay, right. So if I pull up my map, right, we got some things going on there. Okay, cool. Well, you know, these games, they're a slow burn. At least it did give us a little bit of combat. It's got an interesting story hook, you know. 
A lot of uh, the information is obfuscated. They're kind of setting you up to be the bloody Neo, the Chosen Ones, I guess, which I'm not a huge fan of, but, you know, writer's going to write. Um, but, uh, yeah, I kind of I kind of do like that. They just haven't just laid it down on you. It was pretty... All the banter from the, the la lords and ladies was a little bit, you know, a bit long in the tooth, but whatever, you know. Um, all in all, it's pretty cool so far. But this is the best I can do with the 30-minute slot to show off the game. Check it out! Uh, I feel like... Um, uh, maybe you don't know that this game's out, so my hope is that this is helpful in letting you know because the, the fan base of this sort of game, of the, the CRPG of uh, yesteryear, you know, the, the classic sort of throwback, it, it is a niche, but uh, it has its rabid fan base, so my, my hope is that, you know, maybe you didn't know about it and I've shown it to you and you've gone, oh, bugger it, I'm going to get it. So, you know, let me know if you do pick it up on the back of this video because that's what makes my day. Anyway team, might just leave it there for the time being and I'll catch you guys on the next one.